G'day and welcome to the day 12 coverage of the Olympic Games. Now first I'm going to talk about something that happened a while ago, I think it was like day 3 or 4 of the Olympics in the pool. Now Cameron Vandenberg won the 100 meter breaststroke and got the gold medal for it. So he won the 100 meter breaststroke, he won about like that much and got a gold medal. Now the thing is, is he cheated. We all know he cheated. There was underwater cameras that show he took extra dolphin kicks when he only allowed to take one. He took about three or four. And the thing is, is he's admitted to it. He admitted to cheating. And they're not going to take the gold medal off him. He said, yes, I cheated. I cheated because if I didn't cheat, I wouldn't have won. Mm, yeah, I don't know, so his morality is not there. He's like, if I didn't do underwater dolphin kicks because they can't see it, someone else would have done underwater dolphin kicks and they would have won and I wouldn't have wanted to lose because someone else did underwater dolphin kicks. But the thing is, is he didn't follow by the rules. The whole thing about rules is you have to follow by, and the Olympics is all about fairness and stuff. And the thing is, is nobody else did extra underwater dolphin kicks. And he beat Christian Springer, the Aussie dude. Now, he's an awesome dude. He got silver in that, he got second, and he loved it. He won it. He was happy with himself. But imagine how much happier he would have been if he got gold because the other dude didn't cheat. Cameron Vandenberg, you're a cheater and you know it. But anyway, let's get to day 12 because we've got another gold medal. So the guys in the 49ers are sailing, won a gold medal. The thing was, was we knew they were going to win. They just had to go out and compete in the last attempt to sail the last event. That's all they had to do. They went out, they enjoyed themselves. They came home winners. The reason why they were winners from the get-go is because there's so many events leading up to it that they were so far ahead that nobody could catch up to them. So they, got the, they took out the gold medal there. So congratulations, boys. So we're now in 11th place with, place with five gold. And I believe we still have 12 silvers and about nine bronze medals. Um, in other news, there wasn't too much... Uh, Taekwondo guy Kali is going off to um, play for bronze, play for bronze, and unfortunately the boys in the men's water polo, uh, they were leading 7-4 at half time and unfortunately lost to Serbia 11-8, so unfortunately they don't go through to the semi-finals and they'll go through to play for 5th to 8th and assuming they should get 5th, but good on your boys, it's a young team so they should go well, um, there wasn't much else out happening other than the sailing, uh, Hooker went through into the... Uh, to the final for the pole vault, um, well, some other stuff happened, and yeah, a bit of question stuff, didn't go too well, but yeah, anyway, thanks for watching, I'll see you tomorrow, and uh, yeah, hit that like and subscribe button, and if you've only been watching me for the Olympics, wait till after the Olympics, I'll go back to my normal daily routine of daily videos, and I've got some cool stuff lined up, so thanks for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow.